Hi Gav, we sit here after yesterday's 2-0 defeat to Connors Key. How do we react to that game? Um, well, the reaction is going to be about the next game. Um, in terms of reflections, me personally, um, one of huge pride really. Um, you know, a, a real patched up squad. Um, lads really, um, you know, taped up if you like, trying to get through the game. And I think that for um, the first half, I think that you know we had some really good moments in the game that maybe we should capitalise on. The win in the second half was was horrendous and, spe- and spoilt any occasion of what is football. You know, it wasn't. It was sport yesterday. It was competitive, but it wasn't really football. Um, and you know, Konski, you know, put us under a lot of pressure in the second half. Um, you know, he was quite relentless at times, but the lads stood firm. And you know, I think that uh, the stats will come out. We probably defended 30, maybe 40 balls into our box at times, um, and we passed the test on all occasions, bar one. So disappointing, but uh, one of huge pride. And I think the hurt that we feel now will will help us grow and help us uh, improve as a team. Obviously, you mentioned it just then. The squad's been hit by a lot of injuries recently. Have you got any updates on those injuries? Um, injuries and, and and suspensions, yes. You know, so um, you know, in terms of the immediate concerns, um, Callum now goes in for um, a planned hip operation, um, and we'll look after as best we can his uh, his recovery. This has been something that's been a long time coming, um, and we'll hopefully allow Callum to pay, play pain free, which I think is really important for him in the future. So that's a really, you know. In, in weird ways, exciting thing for him because, you know, he's been suffering with this for a long time. So, so that's uh, that's going to happen this week. Um, Robbie's near in fitness. Um, he won't be available during this phase, but the hope is he's available in the next phase, and and that'll be a, a boost to us. Um, uh, I wouldn't say Jack Jack Compton's coming back from injury. He came back yesterday uh, for a short period, and I will continue to step up his progress, and uh, that'll be a a boost to the squad as well. Um, but. Apart from that, then just the, the illnesses that took some of the lads out from yesterday. So, yeah, a bit light, but um, you know when we get the couple of boys back now, then uh, we'll be hopefully back up to uh, near full strength. Obviously, we're here today to uh, sign a player that we'll be announcing soon enough. Can we expect any more signings this window? Um, yeah, today's a good day. Um, just uh, you know, it's nice to get uh, this guy over the line. We want to work with him for a long time. Um, fits our mould really well. Um, he's a good technical player. Um, been training with us for a while now and has really fitted seamlessly into into the into the squad with the lads. So uh, that's always a great indication for me and looking forward to, to giving them the platform to, to show his, his undoubted talents. In terms of others, um, yes, I think we could probably see some movement both in and out. Um, you know, over the next sort of uh, week to, to ten days, you know, we might see some additional movement as well. I wouldn't say masses, but maybe maybe one or two in and uh, maybe one or two out. Cheers, Gav. Thank you.